foreign ministers of Armenia and Azerbaijan have accepted the OSC Minsk Group co-chair's proposal to meet soon under their auspices, and they will announce the details at the appropriate time. Co-chairs summed up their regional visit, during which they held meetings in Yerevan, Stepanagert and Baku. The main purpose of the visit was to assess the evolution of the situation on the line of contact and the international border, and to follow up on the discussions held by the Azerbaijani president and the Armenian prime minister in Vienna on March 29th and their respective foreign ministers in Moscow on April 15th. President of Armenia Armen Sarkisian has nominated attorney Vahe Grigorian as candidate for judge of the Constitutional Court. The president hopes that by being elected judge of the Constitutional Court, Grigorian will contribute to the increase of effectiveness of the activities of the court, full implementation of constitutional justice, and full exercise of the powers reserved to the judge of the higher court by law, the president's office said in a statement. Former European weightlifting champion representing Armenia, Mel Deluzia, was hospitalized in Amsterdam after being stabbed in a robbery attack. The embassy of Armenia and the Netherlands said Deluzian has been helicoptered to a hospital and will spend a few more days there. A friend of his had informed on Facebook that two masked persons armed with a knife on Thursday afternoon had tried to rob the cash register of a supermarket in downtown Amsterdam, threatening a supermarket clerk and Delusion was stabbed when he had come to the aid of this clerk. Narina Khachadurian, a member of the majority of my step faction in the National Assembly of Armenia, has announced that she will be giving up her parliament seat. The lawmaker has submitted a respected petition to the parliament's chairmanship. According to some reports, Khachadurian will be appointed Deputy Minister of Education, Science, Culture and Sport. Prime Minister Nikol Pashinyan has proposed members of a Council of Europe delegation to engage in judicial reforms in Armenia. The Prime Minister met with a Council of Europe high-ranking mission led by Director General Christor Gionabopoulos of the Council of Europe, Director General for Human Rights and Rule of Law, and which has arrived in Armenia to assist in the judiciary reforms in the country. The visiting Council of Europe representatives assured that the Council of Europe stands ready to work closely with the Armenian government and the respective process of reform. Music